Hey there, fellas. My name is Broken Bob. Hey, Bob. Um, we were hoping to interview you about some of those um, posts you've been putting on social media. So there I was. I was on my social medias, posting on the subreddit. I was a big shot. I was making Mondo cash. I was fucking killing it. But then I got laughed off of the subreddit. That sounds terrible. What exactly happened? I went on Twitter one day, and I got ratioed by my bank. I made a poor decision. I made many poor decisions. I fucked up an investment. I posted on the, on the, on the subreddit. I got negative karma. I lost oh. all my karma. My Reddit gold is gone. And when I went to my bank, I, I, I talked to my bank's brand account on Twitter. I tried to tell them, hey, I made a bad decision financially. And you know what they said? L plus ratio Bob. I tried to apply at the McRonald's Burger Emporium and Mortgage Agency. And they not only didn't hire me, they preemptively fired me. And they said that you will never be able to take a loan out for a synthetic hamburger ever again. I was on a YouTube channel. I was evicted. The landlord, he, he made a vlog about it. It's called Land Chat Evictions. Watch me evict this dipshit. I stick dogs on him on YouTube. And now I can't buy anything. Because money doesn't... We don't use money anymore. We don't use paper. That was outlawed in 2037 when the, from the massive paper shortage. People sent me money all over Twitter because they felt bad for me. But I can't get a phone. I can't even get a loan for a phone. That's just awful, Bob. Best of luck to you. Best of luck to me? Best of luck to me? I tell you what's lucky, this can of cat food. That's lucky. And tonight, that's dinner. Um, yeah, Bob. Uh-huh. Oh, I can't believe I lost my entire portfolio. Low budget film review by Cleveland Film 1997. Action. Hey guys. Okay. I, I got a new film to review today that you should all go check out. It's called Watchmen 4 Revenge of Man Man. It's directed by Jeremiah Snyder. Uh, he as you know, great granddaddy son of Zack Snyder. In this movie, a lot of cool stuff happens. I hope you enjoy the movie. Cybercorn yield is really coming through. I'm gonna make it big as freak this year. Hi there, I see you're tending to your virtual crops. How's the harvest? Who the hell asked? What's it to you? To me, that's who. So I uh, hear you're an enterprising farm coin farmer. Why don't you take a look at my package? They'll let you get it big. What the hell is that? I don't care about none of that. 
Please, just buy this package, please. Come on, man. It's just five farm coin a month, eggplant coin, the cheapest kind. Please, come on, I need this. Whoa, whoa, man, okay? Like, what's going on here? I'm gonna be frank with you, man. I haven't made a sale all day. I'm in high water. If I don't make a sale within the next five hours, they're gonna demote me, for sure. I'm gonna become a server. What's wrong with being a server? I mean, back in my teenage years, in the tens, when I was a server for a family joint, it wasn't that bad before everything was delivery, you know? Whoa, whoa, yeah, I think you're thinking of a different kind of server. Oh, they're gonna vacuum my brain out and then put on a podium and I become a server. What the fuck, isn't that like illegal? Well, didn't you hear? Just recently, uh, Cyborg Mega President Ted Nugent made it law. The problem is, if I can't get this sale and I get demoted, then I lose my job and I'll go homeless. I'm guaranteed to get liquidated by the State Beautification and Property Value Index Fund. Whoa, whoa, okay? Just calm the fuck down, all right? Maybe you won't need to have your skull violated. Maybe you could start up some kind of business of your own. Say, that's a pretty great idea. No, really, thanks. Here's, here's one for the road. What the fuck? Hey you, ever wonder why your hard drives and your servers and your websites aren't working so good anymore? Ever wonder what you needed to make your work just work? Now you too can have your own personal server in your home with the power of broken. <coughs> yes, you heard me right. I'm selling you personal servers powered by the brains of Woodley Critters. You see, they act as the processors in this operation. Drag down your prices as I drive my Jeep Titan Cherokee to the bank and run over a few dozen deers and squirrels. <laughs> Buy your own server today for only .025 crypto bananas. Supply is limited. Get them before the highway does. <laughs> Offer not available in Neo Alaska, New York, or Rhode Island. International Seals Inc. is not responsible for any injuries caused by Woodland Creature servers. Don't delay. Call today. Shipping and handling not included. American values, that's what we all like most here. Freedom, liberty, the pursuit of happiness. As Americans, it is our imperative right and duty to hate other cultures and groups of people. The liberal academics in most universities will try to teach people on the humanistic and wholesome aspects of loving thy neighbor. We must be accepting of others. I find this to be nonsense. Dear liberals, Fuck you. And anything that is done against you or your families is fair game. Dear liberal academics, your mother, signed Paris. When I held my Slayer U poll on Twitter, I was asked many things. From one user named Bimbo Slayer of Topeka, they say, quote, Harris, I've heard a lot about abortion. What can you tell us about the liberal standpoint on abortion? Well, at Bimbo Slayer of Topeka, I can tell you this. The godless liberals want nothing but your suffering. They want us all to go by these wacky things called pronouns, and the voices in my head by liberal god are telling me they want me to kill this baby. This is what the evil liberal voices mean when they talk about women's choice. Joe Biden? More like, Joe God make the voices stop. Women did this to me! No. <sighs> <laughs> Liberals, like most infectious diseases, spread most in cities, 
Surely we must be in hell. This is the liberal standpoint on abortion. Slager U is where the facts of life live. Have you ever wanted to prank your friends really good? Well now you can by stealing their identity because you can prank your friends with deep fakes. Wow, I just stole my friend's identity. Damn, With son. our new deep learning AI algorithm and our ad tracking cookies and trackers, we can spy on your friends and clone their entire social media so you are indistinguishable from them. Why are there 47 of me on Facebook? Owned like a newbie. Ah, ah. Call now to receive our 45 second free trial of Photoshop. Call today to deepfake your friends and get the ultimate revenge. Deepfake Your Friends, a subsidiary of the Deepfake Company, claims no responsibility or liability for any damages, ruined marriages, divorce, or homicide that may incur from the use of this product. Don't wait. Call today to Deepfake Your Friends. Wow. I sure do feel rather drowsy after working so hard for my boss. Maybe I should go get a cup of coffee so I can stop feeling drowsy and work harder for my boss. Time to get a mug of coffee. I love coffee. What the hell? What? How? What? 